Princess, I am so sorry. I should have known that Medallion was a trap. Mortis's guards took your nanny away and locked me in here. But take this key. You must go to the castle. Fulfill the prophecy. Defeat Mortis once and for all. Wait here. Once the Princess of Fire arrives, seize her and deliver her to the castle. There are guards everywhere, but I have a plan. We need to put him to sleep. There's a sleeping potion in the medicine box. We just need to pour it in his cup. This dose will put him right to sleep, but if he drops at his post, it'll cause suspicion. Let's lure him away and tie him up. Here, there's a bell above the door. Let's make some noise. Princess of the Fire Kingdom, I order you to come with me. <sighs> Amazing! I'll go call for help. Hurry to the castle before Mortis hurts your nanny.
Thank you, Princess. I hail from the Dragon Kingdom. My Princess and I came here to stop Mortis, but that witch defeated us and conquered our kingdom. You are our last hope to fulfill the prophecy. I shall do what I can to help you. I will distract Mortis's guards while you run to the castle. Here, this will help you get inside. Good luck.
You may not pass until the bridge is restored. only will the Fire Kingdom be destroyed, but you'll help me do it.
Hey, you're not our sister. Who are you? Alan, don't you recognize the Fire Kingdom princess? That prophecy is about you, right? Of course I knew it, Toman. A anyway, Morris locked herself in a secret room. It's guarded by a three-headed dog. She said she just needs you to finish her enslaving ritual. Then we need to hurry. These medallions will help you get past the dog. Little toys won't work on me. I serve my queen with all my heart. You should be honored. You are the final ingredient that heralds her ascension. <laughs> <laughs> 